Good evening. Um, okay, so I finished my watercoloring. Um, you can't really, I don't know if I can even get in there really to see it real well, but I, I don't like the way it turned out. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, these brushes really kind of suck. Like this big one, when I tried to use here, um, uh, okay. When I used this big one, yeah, I didn't let it drive well whatever anyway um I was getting this paper wet and it was leaving bristles everywhere like you can just see them they're like falling out oh my god there's see there's one right there this these oh I'm gonna buy better brushes I think because these ones are terrible like I don't know why they keep bending I didn't leave these in the water, you know. I would wash it out, and then I would dry it off, and then I'd put it back in my in back in my cup, right? So I don't know what 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 they're doing. So they're just this brand. Uh, hold on, Let's see if I can even get that to focus. Hmm. Well, there we go. There we go, finally focused. And I'm like, this is a terrible brand. So I was having that kind of trouble with this. And then I tried using like a small brush like this one. And it kept keeps doing like, it'll come apart like this. So these are just terrible, terrible. I was just having issues with these. So I, what I eventually ended up doing was, okay, here's what it looks like completed. Um, this is my first attempt at watercoloring with color pe watercolor pencils and then I like I didn't like the way it turned out so I ended up using some of uh, my my very old Prismacolor of oh, I think I've had these since I was 20 I got them as a present from my then boyfriend but now husband um, I didn't know that they were artist quality back then I just knew they were really fancy color pencils because uh, most of the time I just used cra uh, you know Crayola or whatever just happened to be the local brand or whatever just for color pencils that's what I the only thing I've ever used growing up so anyway so this is how it turned out and I ended up um, not really liking I put this purple in at the top and I couldn't get I couldn't get one of these brushes well, I just picked a random one, not this one specifically, because this was not it. I can't remember. I think it might have been, might have been this one, and it kept fraying out because it what when I first got it, it had a nice point to it, and then I washed it, and then uh, when I tried to use it, it just kind of. Oh, was it? I'm sorry. Maybe it was this one. Oh, it was this one. Sorry. Rephrase that. Okay, so it was this one. And I would use it, and I just couldn't push this this uh, color around. I'd get it wet, and then I got it really wet or at one point, like right over here. And I made my purple go away. And, oh, no, sorry, it was up here. I made my purple go away, and I was like, what? <laughs> so, I don't know. Like I said, you can tell this looks like very amateur. Oh, and the reason why the shading on this is completely wrong it's because when I drew this one, I drew this intending it for it to be right here. And then I was going to draw another flower up here and another flower here. But I don't know at some point during my wonderful coloring, because I had to stop every so often and color. Somehow I got this paper flipped around and then I was like, before I knew it. And I was like, oh my God, I just screwed this whole thing up. So... I just went with it, and so I got the color the wrong way, but oh well. <laughs> I don't know if anybody would notice it if they didn't watch the video, but um, I don't know. Maybe I would enjoy this better if I had a better brush. Like I said, they're all bending. I don't understand. And then, like, the, the hair keeps falling out of them, and these metal things, like this one, this metal thing is really loose like it's loose I don't know it just these are must be really shitty I mean I don't know whoops <laughs> I'm obviously showing it the wrong direction but like this one is so I don't know you can see all the fur sticking out of it 
fur. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, so that was, this is number one. And this one I haven't done anything with yet. It's just going to be a simple tree. Let me move my water paint, my, my uh, paper towel away, out of the way. Um, I just used, what colors? I just used these two colors on it because this pack doesn't really come with a lot of colors. Let's see if I can get the color to show up. If not, oh well. Anyway, I used these two colors. Nope, you really can't tell. I didn't want it to. Uh, anyway, I used these two colors. So, um... I don't know how it's going to turn out. And then down here is just brown and light brown and a little black. Eh, I don't know. I don't even have any idea if this is... I'm, I'm used to coloring. But like I said, I'm learning how to color as a, in watercolor. I don't even know if this is how you do it or not. And then, like, I'll take the water and then I'll try to soften up these lines. I'm not gonna do it on here because I, I wanna be able to see and not just look through my phone's viewfinder. But I will uh, go like this and hopefully try to soften up some of these lines and make more of a, I don't know, uniform looking tree. Cause right now it looks just like a bare bones tree. But anyway, don't be too critical of my work. This is just my first time and I, don't know how this turned out real well or not. I mean, I, I don't know. I, I kind of liked, liked it a little. I mean, I did like the purple around the outside. It made it look like it was, sh like they were tipping this way. But I didn't want to use purple. But I didn't have another a deeper color of, you know. I didn't. I, I don't know. I just didn't know how to do it. And these, oh, I didn't like the way these turned out. This one I didn't mind so much, but this one bothered me. I didn't like the way this one turned out. Um, anyway, you see, like I said, this the shading. I don't know what I was thinking. The shadows are like all over the place on this picture. Like, okay, you got shadowing this way, and then shadowing on this side, and it's like, ah. <laughs> Anyway, okay, bye.